with my outfit for today. I'm gonna run a few errands, hop into the grocery, pick up some avocado toast. Well, actually, I don't know if I'm doing bread, but this is my look today. Funnily enough, I don't seem to have a full-length mirror at home, but um, yeah, let's do this. <laughs> every single time I try to record something. Um, it's a public holiday here today. I'm not going to tell you guys why because I keep getting it wrong. So. Guys, my favorite. I absolutely love smoked salmon. I'm going to get back on that health kick real quick. doing some work, some being oh, domesticated. Yeah, right. He loves carrying that, pushing that trolley. Guys, we're done and we're heading home and I'm craving tea, milk tea, Sri Lankan milk tea. How much time did you take? Uh, an hour. No, actually maybe two, two hours. Mm. Could be cute. Uh, maybe an hour and a half. Guys, I bought so much avocado and salmon. I'm about this avocado salmon health kick life now. It's all about nutrition and just eating multiple meals a day. I'll either become really fit or really obese. Either way, it's gonna be fun. <laughs> Guys, so Sunny just finished taking a few pictures for me. I don't know if you can see him. So. I don't know what he's doing right there, but um, yeah, we just finished taking a few pictures and we're about to go commence with the weekend. Well, I'm going to ditch him, but yeah, pretty much ditching the gig, ditching him. Dimitri, what do you think is the most important thing to have during this fall season? I am a big fan of faux fur. I think you should have as many faux fur coats as possible. And if you're not a faux fur person, I think a good leather jacket or a denim jacket, maybe from H&M, um, never fails you, never. And of course, for those of you who love luxury, Gucci, Gucci all the way, Gucci all day, every day. I think that's pretty much it. What about you? What do you think? No? No. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Not, Not today. But is there any particular colour that you're feeling this time of the year? Um, black, grey, white. I think black is just super. Can't go wrong with black. Black every day all day. And what's your favourite piece of clothing that you own that you um, could not live without? white fur that I'm going to shoot for you guys today. Yeah. And 
they can't pitch enough that in. Great. Do you want to do it in the corner yeah, over there? Let's do it here. Guys, we're done. I got some amazing shots thanks to Cassie, who's taking time out of her weekend to help me. And I'm going to be putting it up on my Instagram. I'm sure by the time this video is out, you guys would have already liked it, seen it. But some more love will never hurt, never hurt anyone. More love, more kisses, more grinder dates. No, no grinder. I don't believe in that, but I am on grind. Just letting you know. Let's go watch a movie. Oh, hey, you're back to filming. <laughs> I am. Uh, what did you think of the movie we just watched? It was good, but, but with any horror movie, you expect so much and get so little. Yeah, I know. I feel like every other horror movie. So for you guys who don't know, I'm a big horror movie fan. I literally watch horror movies every time. And funny fact, I typically do not like watching horror movies at the cinema because I do not get scared with annoying people around. I like watching horror movies by myself in the dark to get the true impact of the movie. That's weird, um, but I love my horror movies. And I did not like this movie. I feel like Slumber, the movie me and Cassie just watched, was a snooze. Uh, it was a bit of a snooze and it was a bit of a rip-off of Insidious, don't you think? Definitely. The plot is a bit overused now. Definitely. The plot is overused, as with many people. Um, okay, so take a seat. Let's talk about the brand for a second. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm actually wondering if we should do a Facebook ad for Avastave. And for those of you who don't know, I have my own emerging label called Avastave. It is luxury pretty couture, which means there's only one size and it's made for you, the customer. And right now we're selling online, but I'm trying to figure out if we should run a Facebook ad to attract more, um, more people to the website, basically. And Cassie, I had a question for you actually. I'm a bit concerned. I'm not sure if the website, sorry, I'm not sure if Facebook runs ads for a specific amount of money and I'm not too sure if that means if every time somebody clicks on the ad, does that mean that I get charged? Because girl ain't got that much money in the bank. Like, she, What's the charge amount that they've mentioned on the website? Well, you, can, you can kind of fix your own budget. Okay. I can put like, for example, if I put 10 dirhams a day, not 10 dirhams, like let's say 10 dirhams a week, so like one dirham a day for 10 days. But I feel like every time someone clicks on it, I'll be charged 10 dirhams. I don't think that's realistic um, no. because that would mean if 10 people click your ad in one day, you're going to get charged yeah, like 100 dirhams. I feel like that's their really tiny text, which is why I'm so worried about it. Like I don't really know. I don't know. Anyway, I think that's a conversation for a separate day. I think we should discuss that perhaps later in the day once we're done with this shoot. So I'm super excited to do this photograph today. I am going to give you guys a secret garden fantasy moment. Um, let's go into my closet. Yeah, let's do that. I feel like I'm smoking way too much, by the way. You're fine. Yeah. <laughs> so. Guys, I apologize, nothing in my closet is synchronized. It's like, it's so dark and I just really need to figure out what I'm gonna wear. I know it's super dark because I don't have enough lighting in here and I only have one window. So, hold on while I pick my outfit. So I wanna give you guys a pink look, a pink moment, but I'm not too sure. What about this, what do you think? It's pretty. Um, you can take it with you. Maybe we can try it on. Yeah, and I think see it's how it looks. Like maybe yeah. this pink Zara fur. And then I have these. Um, I can't remember where I bought them from. Actually, are they? Oh, Zara too. That's like a Zara pink trouser that I quite like. That I snapped up. Just snatched it from the girls. And I was thinking this tropical moment. Like it'll be cute. No, like a paired kind of. And I'll be squatting in that garden just giving you guys all kinds of fall Gucci vibes. Actually, Gucci did not create a garden. They just lived up to the whole garden fantasy retro vibe. So, I don't know. I'm kind of going to give you a secret garden moment. I'm trying to stand out from the rest of the girls. What do you think? I'm excited. <laughs> I mean, I just can't wait As to see it. As you should be. Okay, cool. Uh, so get out now so that I can change. Goodbye. <laughs> okay,
So we're gonna go try and shoot in this little spot of greenery that's outside where I stay. And let's just hope that we can get in there and not be shooed off by the security. Although if someone tries to come for me, I will cut a bitch because it's a cute spot to shoot. So sunny. You good? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna hand you the fur. Oh, shit. oh so dirty. Cass, just come down here and start to make up. The oh. truest smoke. And. It would be so funny if it doesn't break, but I fall over back.
put me on the record saying I love you Even if it's cause we're high top floor with the view Vibes so fly and the fuck so fly Super busy, just ordered in the and me and Cassie are gonna go with what are we going with? The dark and stormy, and it might guess dark and stormy after this particular cocktail, but we're willing to try it. Yeah, right? Just living life on the you edge. Can try everything once. Right, that's true. Mm -hmm. I'm living for this presentation. It's like on point. Love it. Really good. You want to try mine? I didn't even try mine yet. Why not? Getting the camera woman drunk. I love it. Mm, dark and strummy got oh, you yes. good, huh? <laughs> so Dimitri, how has your day been so far? It's been great. I'm a bit tired from the shoot. Yeah. And getting up on that scaffolding was tough, but the picture looked great. Um, and yeah. I know you enjoyed it too, secretly. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, who wouldn't? I mean, exactly, yeah. So what was uh, the best part about the shoot? Definitely getting up on that scaffolding and the pink fur. I absolutely love that. But I'm balling on a budget, as I mentioned to the girls before, so I can't buy any furs at the moment. But I enjoyed it nevertheless. I'm giving you a military moment tonight, just representing the military girls, making those army plans. That's nice. Well, it's December, it's the Christmas season, the holiday Four. season, but Festive. what is the best thing? That that's happened to you like the last two months? Well, I think it's just starting this vlog. I think starting this vlog and getting back into my blogging has just really helped me be, get in touch with that creative part of myself that I lost while I was working. I think once you start doing a full time job, it is difficult for most bloggers and bloggers and creatives to really stay true to themselves. And I think just having this time off and looking for a new company and has allowed me to really find myself again, which is great. And of course, having amazing friends like you. Hey. Always a good plus point. Always, like, always. Pretty much it. So, we're here at Toko tonight, and I'm just ready to stuff myself with all the sushi and dumplings and everything else that I can find. It's the perfect weather to come here because it's beautiful. Uh, it's rained a bit today for the first time in a long time, so everything is wet. Wetter than a month. I'm not going to start rapping because I can't rap something right now. But, um, yeah, so let's get ready to stuff our faces. I wish you love.